Hi, this is Linda Rogers with Planning Within Reach. I recently saw a private screening for a documentary here in San Diego. It was called Playing With Fire. Fire stands for Financial Independence Retire Early. So this is a movement of people that are retiring at age 30 or 35, but much earlier than the standard age 65. And they're doing it by really increasing their savings rates. So the documentary itself followed a couple that was renting in Coronado, California. And from when they found out about FIRE and the steps they took to get on track to retire in 10 years, so while they were still in their 30s, instead of in 35 years, which is what they were on track for. The first thing they tackled was housing. So they moved from Coronado to Bend, Oregon, where they were able to buy a house. And it talked about their savings rates in the beginning of the movie. They were saving about 8% of their income. And by the end of the movie, they made a series of changes to where they were saving to just over 50% of their income. So housing was a big chunk of that. They also talked about car expenses. So the wife was leasing a BMW for about $400 per month. She ended up buying a used car and having no car payment going forward. They met with someone who said just by implementing that change alone with the car, they would reduce their working years by five years. So I thought that was pretty powerful, that it was measuring their different financial decisions in life by the number of years it was making them work. And I think they said in the movie, too, that the wife felt, you know, she deserved a nice car. And I think we all do feel that in some respect, at some point, that we deserve this car or this house or this vacation. And we do. We deserve the things that give us joy and make us happy. But when you think about it in that perspective, that, yes, by doing that, though, you're working X number of years, it does make you think about it differently. They talked a little bit about food expenses, but they really didn't go into much more detail than those two main things about the housing and the car situation. They do have a book also called Playing With Fire, where my understanding is they do dive into the details and the numbers about their personal situation, but also the fire theory itself. I have not read it, but someone at the screening mentioned that. And I think the FIRE movement itself is great. It's about being intentional with what you want out of your life and what you're spending money on today. I think some of our concerns have been just the rules of thumb. So in the movie, for example, they said your FIRE number is take your current expenses, times it by 25, and when you have that amount of money, you can retire. Well, that's based on this 4% rule. The 4% rule in financial planning is that if you have a pot of money, when if you take 4% of that every single year, you'll never run out of money. The theory though was based on a 30 year time horizon. So if you're retiring at age 65, you live to age 95, that works. If you retire though at age 35 and live to 95, that's now 60 years. It also doesn't go into the details of how the money has to be invested. For example, there needs to be a minimum amount of stock in that investment portfolio to be able to pull 4% from it. You also need to look at the tax qualifications of your assets. Are they going to, is the money going to be fully taxable when it comes out? Is it tax-free? Also, by looking at your current expenses, there are things like medical costs that are going to be much higher when you're no longer working. Most people have employers that are subsidizing their medical expenses today or paying for them. So that needs to be accounted for. Also thinking through things like long-term care costs and nursing home care. So in general, rule, rules of thumb are great. We do use them a lot. I think it's a good starting point, but having an objective third-party person to just kind of verify your assumptions, especially before you do pull the plug and retire is always a good idea. So again, my name is Linda Rogers. Our firm is Planning Within Reach. We're in space in San Diego, but we help clients all throughout the country. Please reach out with any questions.